Hello, this is Eric Steiler, your Portland Community Realtor. Today I'm going to teach you how to search homes for sale on my website. There are several places you can go to search homes. You can click on the neighborhoods, you can click search listings, or you can just click search property listings. Essentially, they're going to take you to my map. If you go to neighborhoods, it'll take you to a smaller view, certain neighborhoods. We clicked on Alameda. It's going to have some information about Alameda neighborhood. You can scroll down and this is a list view of the 16 homes for sale in Alameda right now. Looking at 2033 Northeast Alameda. If you like this property, you can click Save as my favorite and every time you log in it will be listed as one of your favorites so you can keep tabs on it, see when it goes pending, if there's any price drops. You can request a showing if you want to see it. If you have questions about this property, just click Contact Agent. You can print it, you can email it to a friend, you can share it on Facebook or Twitter, and you can view it on the map. Now if you click view on the map, it takes you to the map of, of uh, Alameda. Also um, if you had clicked view property listings from the front page, it would have taken you to a map view of Portland. So in this case, here's all the properties on a map in Alameda. I typically work out of the map view just because I like being able to see these properties. Blue properties are ones that have been on the market. Green are new listings that you haven't seen yet. Maybe they just came on the last day. Now one nice thing about the map view is that I can search several areas. So I'm going to shrink it down a little bit and I'm going to click Irvington, Grant Park, Hollywood, and Alberta Arts. Now it's going to show me all properties for sale in those neighborhoods. So like I clicked a few too many too fast. It's going to just take a second to catch up. So now I'm clicking on properties in those neighborhoods. I'm going to make the map a little bit easier to read. And one thing you can also do is change your criteria. So you can see there's a lot of houses right now. So I'm going to click on this search criteria button. And maybe I only, I only want to see properties for sale between 500 to 600,000 and three to four bedrooms. And maybe I don't want to deal with short sales, and I don't want to see any bank-owned properties, and I only want to see residential, so no condos or attached houses. I click Apply. It's still going to search in these neighborhoods, but notice there's a lot fewer properties. Now if I want to add more neighborhoods, I can do that as well. Or if I want to start over, I can click this Reset the Map button and it'll take you out to a wider view of the Portland area. And now if you click on the map and scroll, just kind of move your mouse, it'll take you out if you want to see other areas as well. So maybe I want to see Troutdale. I'm now out in Troutdale. I can even take it a little further into the outlying areas. You can also go west. So this way you can kind of Hone in your search wherever you want. And click on Selwood now. And same thing, it's going to pull up properties in Selwood, Moreland. And again, I can reset the criteria. It looks like there's 54 properties for sale. Very easy to use this website. I hope you find it useful. If you have any questions, feel free to contact me. You can call me at 503-888-3111 or just uh, send me an email. Thank you very much.